Um, Beyonce not... wasn't there. Nikki wasn't there. So um, I wasn't there. <laughs> I have one thing to say. Hi. Hi, guys. I'm Gina. I'm Gianni. And today we're going to be rating the Grammy. So today we're going to be rating the Grammys. This is the 62 weeks, 62nd. <laughs> this is the 62nd year of the Grammys and I'm so excited to rate them because I love fashion, I love music. If you don't like fashion and you don't like music, what are you like? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> why are you on this channel right now? No, so the first person that we're going to be giving a 10 to 1, we're going to start off with the lovely and funny Chrissy Teigen. Chrissy Teigen. She is so beautiful. Like, just look at her face. Zoom in on that freaking mug. No, I, that's a real face. She's she always looked like that. Unless she just has a good ass doctor. She's always looks like that. I've seen her in person. All right. Oh, la, 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 la. I love the color. And I like the shoes. I give this a four. It looks like uh, like a flowerish up top and then the bottom. It's like a mini skirt and then she got this leg slit. <laughs> what the fuck it looks, happened? It looks like a mess. <laughs> it's not it's a mess. Messy. It looks very structured and very thought out. But it's just a no. So the next person is Rosalia and Alexander Wang. She looks like an older mom that, you know, she has maybe a nine year old um, that's 32. That's like, I still wanna be young, I still wanna be hip. Um, let's put a belt on it. Let's wear red. Let's wear red leather. Let's just go all out tonight. It's a girl's night. Like, that's what this looks like. Looks like you go into the club and it's a girl's night. Like, like, it's a cute dress, but I it's like not Grammy. I like the earrings. I like the nails. But the dress just throws me off. The red leather fringe asymmetrical cut belt that looked like... What kind of belt is this? What do you call that? Like, three different patterns on um, it. Um, woven. I think. Yeah, woven belt, but if you notice, it's like three different types of woven. It's just, it's just messy. It's giving, giving me um, pussy to the So, um. I like that foot tattoo. So. <laughs> it's a 10. What do you rate this? I give this a, a three. Well, what about her makeup and her hair? Um, it's, it's still a three. It's basic. It's three. It's, I like, I like I said, I'm going to give her points for everything I like. Rosalia. The hair, the nails. Rosalia. The, um, Rosalia. The hair, the nails. Like, her nails are always nice. Hair and nails. Her nails? And it earrings. Like chopstick. Earring. Absolutely not. Next. Who's the next person? Next, we have Maggie Rogers in Chanel. I have no idea who this is, but. I don't either. Let's see the bottom. It's nothing on her, right? She looks very familiar, like Full House-esque. She looks like she is a housewife that knows someone that has the hookup in the Grammys. And it's like, Should babe, we her? can we go, can we go to the Grammys tonight? I know Seth knows Ginger that can get oh, us she's in. she's a singer and a record producer. Oh, for real? What type uh, of singer is Capital she? Records. She was born in 1994? She went to NYU. What? Wow, she's very accomplished. Get it, girl. She got an education, and she's only 25. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's turning 25. Her birthday is April 25th. Oh, no, she turned 25 already. I can't. She I don't know, man. <laughs> um, I don't know. I never heard her music, but kudos to her for making it to the Grammys, unlike myself. <laughs> um, but let's talk about her fit, though. She's a very accomplished woman. She's clearly beautiful, but let's talk about the fit. Chanel is an iconic brand, but one thing that I'm not caring for is uh everything. <laughs> like, I don't like it at all. Do you know like, what these stars all. remind me of? You know the stickers you used to put in your ceiling? Like with the stars that go on the dark. Oh. That's what it reminds me. Like, it's very um, kids crafty. Like it's about to fall off. Kids crafty. It don't look like 
couture. That's what they call it. This is couture. It is maybe like, ready. It's maybe ready to wear. It doesn't like, look you know, like um like quality. It looks like trashy. But my thing is though too, she looks like she is just showing up and she just her makeup is not there at all. Like. I think she was going for the fresh look. Cause she probably because you know a lot of white women like the fresh look. They don't like to have that full glam, heavy makeup. I think that's look. what she would need though. It'll make this go together. You know what would made this outfit pop? If she would have put it in a ponytail, bitch. She would have put it in a ponytail and maybe like did some studs or something. It probably would have made it pop better next we have misty copeland and she's the ballerina yes the yes. first black ballerina of what somewhere somewhere, uh, somewhere but she's black and I she's the first i can't dance and she well, i don't know she did that she okay she represents a lot of she ballerina. looks like princess and the frog here no am i being stereotypical a stereotypical person I, mean, right now? I like her hair but the dress um She's giving me Princess in the Frog. I don't like that. I think she did that on purpose, though. The belt in the middle. Um, like, I feel it like has to give her a waist. It's 2003, though. That square, the giant square, is like very old. Well, 2003 is back, baby. The 2000, early 2000s I mean, I was cool, is back. was so I, I don't remember that. She's I give four. this a six. I give it a seven. She tried. But she didn't try hard enough. You know? Like some people's best isn't the best. So next we have Ariana Grande and Jim Gian, ba Gian Batista. Bali. Gian Batista Bali. Oh look at you. You're not Italian. Your, your name is Italian. I love it. It reminds me of like a, a modern Cinderella. That. And I think that's what she was going for. Like, this designer is known I kinda for know her. We know each other. Like I know Ariana. You know, she texts me from time to time. We are friends in my mind. And and one day we will be real friends. That's what Kiki Palmer it. said. Remember she said that? What? That they went to the same Nickelodeon school or whatever. They did? Yeah. Because they was in Nickelodeon together. They were? Oh, wow. I didn't but know that. This, this designer is known for making like... Large stuff. Large, fluffy, flowy. I fucking love it. She killed it. The makeup, the confidence. The hair, I'm kind of over the flip look, but it still the looks lips, good. Yeah, I like her new lips. The shade, palm trees all around you. Yeah. This is our rate, Ariana Grande. One through ten. Um, I would give her an eight and a half. I give her a ten because the makeup, the hair is a ten. This is how you want to compile it. The hair, the makeup, and the accessories, and obviously the outfit. Three categories. Boom. That's a fucking 10. She killed that shit. She knows she killed that shit. She was sitting there like, bitch, if you got anything to say about this look, you just a hater. Period. I'm not a hater. I'm not a hater. I'm not a hater. Yeah. I give her an 8.5 out of 10. That's, that's good. That's, that's good. good. All right. So next we have Gwen Stefani in Dulce and Gabbana. She's so cute. I feel like Gwen Stefani. I feel like Gwen Stefani cannot do any wrong. This is like a ballet costume. No, I'm like, honestly, it's giving me 2009. No, it's giving me 2015 um, Balmain. That's what it's giving me. Like the dress? Right? It's giving you Balmain. They have the other, like the um, I feel, uh -huh. embellishment. What? No, this is fire G more. But I don't like these boots. It's not Grammys. Like, I feel like it's not like. It's like a ballerina costume. I mean, that's what I'm getting. Because they spend a lot of time on the costume. Oh, yeah. I see what you're saying now. To me, it's not giving me Grammys. It's giving me more so like oh, Billboard like Awards. The pink lipstick. I don't know. Do you feel like people are not don't dress as like, um, what's the word? Like, they not on brand with the Grammys, in my opinion. They just doing their own thing. They're just trying to get, like, a number one in the newspaper spread or something. Yeah, like, it's... It gives her a number, like, there's a number up there. I don't like it. Like, it's not up there. For sure, like, it's not attention-grabbing, like, but... Like, look at the dress, and then just look at the She just looks happy, and that's what I like to see on her. The, I like them. But together with this... I like it. Like, 
I like it. I, think I don't know. Am better? I cheesy? Cause I I love what's up. She can't do no wrong to me. I don't even listen to her music. Am I just I like her. I think thigh highs are better on women who have thighs. Like she just. No, I love it on skinny girls too. I love thigh highs on skinny girls. It like shows their legs more. No. Anyway, so I give this look a ten. I love it. I fucking love it. I, I love her hair. I love her makeup. I love her dress. I love the shoes. I love how it's like monochromatic, like with her skin and with the hair. It's Mommy, she's been going to the Grimace for too long to be looking like this. So I give it a five out of 10. Um, two more points than Rosalia. And I love Rosalia, so that goes to show that I am This person is Billie Eilish and she is in Gucci. Um, this looks like- On brand, this is her. This is her. This is her, but like Gucci, like, I don't ever like saying G G G G G G G. Those are my initials, but I'm not gonna wear it all over my fucking body. I like the tacky logo shit. Like me, I feel like yes, tacky. Yes, like it's overdone because everyone likes to show in America that they got money. Um, even though ninety percent of us support. Of them, I'm not a part of that. <laughs> never heard of her, never seen her. Um, I feel like the logo that's just American aesthetic, and she's on brand with America. Is she American? Yeah, she's on brand with America. Um, I feel like the green doesn't really go well, like, she looks very like uh, ghastly. Um, she's trying to go for the ghostly look. It doesn't look I like it. I don't, I don't know. know what y'all. This bitch, first of all, let me tell y'all about Billie Eilish. She rubs me yeah, off. Wrong. She's scary. I don't understand. I try to get into her music, and every time I feel like I'm about to enter a nightmare. Like I'm not even trying to be. I'm not even trying to be rude about her music, but like honestly, like it literally frightens me. Like it's something about the lower boom boom. Like it just freaks me out. Like I don't like. Dark sounding like, stuff. I feel like she wasn't trying to catch no viruses with this face mask. <laughs> but I think, but that's her. She's the long nails. You could like it. I uh, love it. I'm gonna give this what I don't. She got two different types of earrings on. Yeah, that's her own brand. Um, she's only 19, so she's still trying to probably find I think her she's look. 18. She's whatever. The bitch is not in her 20s. She's a teenager. She's still trying to figure out her whatever she is. So I put that all into consideration. One second, you're going to relax. So I want to give her. This is her in my eyes. What do you give her? <laughs> what I do give, you her give her a 2 out of 10. I don't like all that. What is it called? Em Embellishments, jewelry, I don't like Gucci, 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 I don't like Gucci, 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 Icon. Gucci, 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 and then you have the sparkly ass Gucci, then you have the sparkly ass undercoat. I don't know what it does hurt your eyes. Um, I'm gonna give her a seven because I felt like I just like the fit. You give this more than Chrissy Teigen? I I don't know how I did that, but you know why? Because it's very really her, but it's very really like. I don't, I don't like, like when she it. wears the branded stuff. Like, I'm you, you know, tacky, Gucci's, so like Gucci's always trying to get like people to love them. And, and um, Billy Irish is someone who a lot of young people and old people love, but I don't like this outfit. I don't like the nails. I like her nails. I just like, I don't know. I don't know why I like this. But she could have put some clippings in there. I think thing. I would have liked it more without the... It's thin. The hair is a um, a four for me. I don't like that. Like, All right, I'm next, next, <laughs> next. We have Tyler the Creator, and he's in his own brand. His own brand. Um, I call it golf, golf something, something golf. We're gonna call this Tyler because that's just who he he's is. Like a bellboy. I that's what he was going for, no bellboy. It looks stupid. I don't know what was um, his thought process and going to the Grammys like that, but um, I like the pink color. Um, I don't like costumes. Like I'm not. I feel like you're making it a joke and making it like people literally put their everything into becoming a musician. Like it's their whole lives. It's all they fucking got. So when people do stuff like this and don't really take like the institution Grammys seriously, even though. 
It is a joke. They they're joke now. Like we're starting to people are starting to open their eyes and be like, woke. Nikki did that for me. <laughs> people are starting to see that the Grammys is a joke, but I still very much don't take it very seriously because that's just me, my personal opinion. Um, say what you want, say how you feel, but it's just like this is a joke. Like what the fuck? So you get a one for, for, for being, and you won't wear fucking dad glasses with it too to add insult to injury. I, I would give it a three. I would give it maybe a four or six if the hat was pink. But if the hat, yeah, hat was okay. pink. Yeah, okay. It's a costume, so you already you already killed nine points Like me. the luggage is pink, the pants, the top. But, but it gave it a little contrast though this. with the pink hat, with the red hat. But you're black wearing pink. A black man wearing pink. That's so, a contrast. Black men don't wear pink <laughs> like that. Yeah, I guess. Next, I'm done with him. Next, we have FK Twigs and Ed Ed Marley. Ed Ed Marley. Marley. Oh. I don't know. I think she looks. Her makeup is beautiful. She looks her hair is beautiful. She looks like the queen of an unknown planet that we haven't discovered yet. <laughs> Steps off the like literally, she is so beautiful. I like, I really don't like it, but I just like the leggings, like in the arm the bodice, yeah. yeah. I like the underneath. Um, I like the sleeve, but it's like that hood, the scrunch around the hood. It gives me like bed sheet. I'm gonna give uh, her or laundry bag. Or a <laughs> you gotta talk up, G. Okay? Bed sheet, laundry bag. Um, I look at earrings. Yeah, she's really pretty. The bodice is pretty. Everything yeah, from like the, the waist bodice. down and underneath that hood is pretty. But it's like offsetting, you know? I would have liked to have seen her hair. She always has interesting hairstyles. I would have liked to have seen her. Um, yeah, I'm going to give her a four because I like her makeup and I like the undergarments. But the top, I don't care for. I really like a page so Next, I'm gonna be buying. Next, we have Lizzo in Atelier Versace. Versace. <laughs> she looks beautiful. She looks slimmer for wear for wearing because white. They have those things on the side. Yeah, and it looks like she probably put a girdle on or something. I like she took it seriously. Like she said, I'm going to the Grammys. She been working for nine years. We kind of look alike. <laughs> she been working on becoming this household name for nine years, and she looks like she appreciates this moment right now. Like it's not a joke to her, and it's not like costumes. It's nice. It's beautiful. She looks like kind of like thirties. She just don't need to show her grill. It's very childlike. <laughs> It's very childish. No one, you cannot catch a break with this motherfucker. Like it's giving me like, like my I teeth. I like her teeth. They're though. not perfect. I, that's what I like about Lizzo. Her teeth. It's like, like her. I like everything but the teeth. Her nails, her hair. I kind of don't like her hair. It's giving me wiggy, like bumpy vibes. It's distracting, like. But childlike, childish, childlike. It's like whoever did her hair, like they. It, it seemed like an amateur wig person. You know, like. It looks like this is different. This is the grand means, bitch. When you, you come, see her everything, like big hair. hair, fucking make her makeup is flawless though. What do you so, her? so I'm gonna give Lizzo a nine because the hair just is too like wiggy for me. Even though it's still beautiful, I just would have wished she would have really like you know maybe it was the wrong angle that we're looking at. But this I'm gonna give her a nine. This is giving me like Mariah Carey like. Deep. Yeah. It's so good. Like I love everything about this look. Like if I was going to the Grammys, this is how I would like to look. Okay. So next we have um Candle Cabello. <laughs> Camilla Cabello and a lot of people wearing Versace tonight. Versace with Le'Veon Drew. Le'Veon. She looks stupid. She looks really cute. I don't really like that whole half short, half long shit, but she looks good. Um, um, her energy is giving me trying too hard, you know, but um, do what you do, baby. I, what do you rate the fashion? So, like, you can see the lace on the outer. It's just giving me really, like, what the fuck is going on? Like, this looks really weird. Like, what is this? What is this? Um, I'm gonna give her... A five. 
My efforts. I don't like this face you make either. What, what's your, what kind of face you call this? Forced. Ugly? <laughs> <laughs> um, I give her a 1.5. No, we cannot be that biased. You got your old being. Alright, uh, next. Not cute at all. Next. Oh, Lana Del Rey! Hey, I love her. Aiden Maddox, I believe. I don't know. I don't know she looks ghostly. It reminds me of like Showgirl. It's From beautiful. the 20s a little bit. I'm, like, I, I kind of like this look. Is this called Chevron? With that print? Yeah, Chevron. That's nice. I like this part because I love Lana Del Rey. I'm biased. So I'm gonna give her. I'm gonna give her a nine right now. That's it. I love the makeup. I love the hair. She doesn't really have accessories. She doesn't need to. The dress is accessories itself. I I'm gonna give her a ten. She killed that. She killed that. She said this was from a mall too. So. A mall? Mm -hmm. What is it? Aiden Maddox. She said she got it from the mall. Oh wow, it's beautiful. Next. Next. Swipe Jason. LMA. LMA. Sweet LMA. Yeah, she did Grammys right. Like she looks it looks like a you know, like the Grammys is but supposed she's to be at a classy event. Yes, a classy event, not a joke. That's what I like. She looks beautiful. She killed that. Her hair, her makeup, her hair is kinda like uh, I like her ponytails. I like her, I don't like the bun. I like her wearing ponytails. Like the ponytails are nice. But she's pretty old. She's beautiful. So I'm gonna give her a 10. I love the shoes. I love the makeup. I love the. Is it wow? Is it like, oh my gosh? She's not known for her clothes though. Like I feel her style. Like the, the jewelry could have been more bling bling. No, I think it's perfect. It's blingy enough. It's, you know, it's. I give her an 8. I give her a 10. It just is what it is. I like the black toes, black nails. Yeah, that's nice. She. Oh, I like that. Next. Next we have. <laughs> John, John Legend, Legend Alexander. He looks great. Um, He's so short. He's so little. I don't like that jacket. I love it. I love it. Is that called pleated? Is that what it's called? Like, yeah, like pleats. It's like a schoolgirl uniform. That's like a and he did it so. Uniform. He did it so elegant, elegantly to me. Like I'm a little biased because he's a Capricorn. I like symmetry. Symmetry is great, and this is not symmetrical. Yeah. All right. So, what do you rate him? Um, maybe if it was even, I would give him a seven because it's not. It's gonna go a three if there's one. I'm Wait. gonna give him a ten. Did she get a three? I don't know what I did, but his like low this year. They got pretty low this year. I, I don't got, like these shoes either. They got together. Look at these shoes. I like it. I like that like weird these are like, like brat store shoes. I like it. <laughs> Like the shoes you just plug in. Like you plug them. <laughs> <laughs> you plug the motherfuckers on. I like it. Next. What is he in? I give him Alexander a Alexander McQueen. Yeah. Next. Oh, um, sweet. sweetie. So witty. So witty. And Machino. Moschino, Machino. She looks very pretty. She's beautiful. She I like that. that top, that ninja knot. Is that what it's called? Yeah. I can't believe she's at the Grammys. Don't stop, get rocks, get pops. Everyone's like toes and my coochie flip pops. And it could have been a crazy number saying stop when he say it not hot. All oh, that shit need to you know stop because I'm like, see, like, see. Niggas wanna. That guy, um, Keith Powers. Oh, for real? He used to date. But now she's the Quavo now, right? Yeah, Quavo. Next. Quavo. What do you give her? What do you give her? I give her a nine. She looks really pretty. Ten. Perfect. She killed it. I like the earrings. Her body. Too. Look at the earrings. Banging. Hair, makeup, banging, makeup, banging, hair, banging, nails, nails banging, ten, ten. She's a cutie, sweetie. Right? She's Becky's He's wearing. He stole a Grammy from Beyonce. Oh, why? So, uh, I'm gonna be unbiased. This, I, I this like it. Like, um, it's different. Every man wears black suit, black suit. You know what remind me of? You know some of those seats that I got like circles on them in a row. It just looks very, <laughs> very, um, gave him. What, what I'm gonna give him a 10, because I like it. I'll give him I like a, glittery, I'll give sparkly him, shit. Uh, 1.5. Uh, this Black China! Next, we got Black China! That's my bitch. I don't know what she wears, I love her. but she's wearing it. Um, I don't care what nobody says, she's a great mother. <laughs> she's a great baby mother, too. She, she was a great woman to. 
raw, but she made his fast lose weight, and look at him now. Oh my God! So, what do you rate Black China one through ten? A ten out of ten. Cause she's Black China. Ten, yeah. All right, next. Pink number eight. Just her face for China. Wait for China. This is um Dua Lipa. Vivian and Vivian Westwood. This is very um. 2001. It's cute. I like it. I like it on her. I like it. It's a satin or silk. It, it looks, looks like satin. I know it's smooth. It looks like silk, actually. I like it. I'll give her a 10. This is Shania Twain. Shania Twain. Oh my god! I love her. I don't know why I love her. I don't even listen to her music, but it's something about her. Every time I see her, Didn't I'm like, make I, I want to be her friend. But what is she wearing? Um, we don't know. We don't know. But they didn't show us. Oh, she has a bag. 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 What do you give her? I give her a 7 out of 10. Um, I like her, but I don't like shorts underneath. Dresses. I don't, I mean, I like the fringy thingy, but um, the belt, it's just a lot going on. And then she got print, oh my God. I like her hair and her makeup. So I'm gonna give her a five, a seven. Why? It's not like too bad. It's not too it's bad, not but it's just what the fuck. I like, like I like the like the sheer. Name. I like the sheerness of it. Maybe if it was panties, I wish I could I see her shoes. It. I want to see her shoes. I, mm, I can't see her. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, she looks short and fouled up. Like a mango short. <laughs> she did go. go. I don't see her though. I have one thing to say. You dirty Bronx bitch! How fucking dare you talk about my look? Like this stupid bitch. You stupid fat bitch, you don't know shit. Look at this little nigga with his twist. How fucking dare he yeah, talk about person. So the last person that we have on the list is Cardi B. She's from the Bronx. She's from the Bronx. We have to I'm not from the Bronx. put her in it. <laughs> He's from the Bronx. By Hunts Point, too. At that. Yes, you are. So, first week we have Cardi B in Moulier. She has Moulier or Moulier. She looks fucking amazing. I love the, the choker with it. I love the diamonds dripping. Her hair, her hair is giving me Atlanta wig. Like, she got her hair up on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She actually is giving me Atlanta wig. Like, you know, I'm gonna you can that. tell who, who, where people get their hair done at. Like, just me, because I love hair. Nobody was, but why do we gotta bring her up? Like we just talking about her look. That's why people. That's why in the beef now because of niggas like you always putting them against each other. We talking about I her look. Giving her vibes. I ain't say. We ain't talking about Nicki Minaj right like now. Yeah, they look very 